So I can say that I have always knew that I, something was different in me and that I always knew that I wasn't like the other boys. So when I discovered that I was gay, that it should have been when I was like 12, and when I discovered what it meant to be gay, um, I was terrified, mostly because of the negative connotation that it has not only in my country, but in society in general. I think that, I think that since then, um, I felt like I lived, like trapped, because it felt like it was like coming home and be, being um, locked into a room and not being able to move out of there. Looking back, I can say that I was really sad. Um, although most of the people that knew me back there um, thought that I was really, really happy. Mostly because I coped with my sadness um, by making others laugh. So I tried to always be like the funny guy in the bunch. But it really was just a mechanism that I used to hide my sadness. But eventually that sadness became a burden, like a heavy weight that I have to carry on. So my came out story was um, that I was forced to came out to my mom when I was 16. And unfortunately, it, it didn't turn out well. Um, it mostly was that my mom overheard a conversation that I was having with my in that time boyfriend. Um, and this sparkled a lot of questions for her. Um, and it clashed with her thoughts and beliefs of what a traditional family should have been and me being the only male in the family um, it was like I was um, responsible for continuing the legacy of my family so my mom thought that me being gay was throwing away that um, so I ended expelled from my home with no money and nowhere to go. To my fortune one of my cousins came to to my rescue and let me crash in his home for a while, a few months. Um, but if I was sad being younger, being expelled from my home and completely alone made me feel terribly depressed to a point that I thought living was no, no, my choice. I, I thought that I should end my life. So fortunately I had friends that helped me overcome that part and helped me get up and um, be better, right? So I had to take ownership of my life since I was very, very young. So my friends and the people that I knew that were going through the same things that I was going through helped me really to get back in track, right? I have always said that the f my friends are the family that I had the pleasure and the fortune to choose to and thanks to them I, I am where I am now so to everyone that is struggling with coming to terms of being accepted as an LGBT person I would like to say to you that you are brave you are valued and accepted and you are not alone.
it might be that the circumstances that you are going through right now are tough and it might seem that you are not gonna get through it but you will you will get through it and let me tell you something that is really really important it all gets better I am a gay person that loves video games I am a gay person that loves geek culture I am Ro, and this is me.